see what we got in here. Oh yeah. Ooh, oh, nope. that's Try no again. Nope. Mm. Muscles, man yep. muscles. Man time. Ooh, peanuts. Ooh. Oh boy. Greetings from Shorts Brewing Company. We've collaborated with the Pure Michigan team. Great team. To bring you an awesome new beer for fall. Pure Michigan Autumn IPA. Wow. Oh, look at that. That's looking good and tasty. B-roll time. B-roll time? B-roll time. Welcome to a very special Bruin Review. When I'm on the internet, I'm watching Bruin Review. Mm, 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 oh boy. Damn, is that good. That's my first taste of this. Oh, it sure is. I was very excited for you to try that. Always go 45 degrees. If you think I know what oh, I'm that's doing, a great point. you're wrong. Look at that. Look at how, oh, look at that color. You guys here? That you guys here for it? Good looking. Ladies and gentlemen, 100% Pure Michigan ingredients in this Shorts beer. Oh, it's so good. That's so cool. It's Shorts Brewery yep. teamed up with Pure Michigan, yeah. and they made this beer where everything is locally grown. Every ingredient is mm. from Michigan. Is that right? Oh, it's so right. We got Valley View Farm. We got Michigan Hop Alliance, Empire Malting Company, Michigan Local Hops and Great Lakes Malting Company, and Craft Cultures from the tip, almost the tip of the Upper Peninsula to that whole kind of northwest side of Michigan. Look at, you know, what's really nice about leaves, I don't know if you guys realize how leaves work, they actually always fall like this, mm -hmm. which is really, really nice. That works out. of Michigan? Yeah, it's just, I don't know, that may or may not be true. It's, it's probably it seems true. true. I believe probably it. Probably true. You are a liar. liar. You are you a liar. liar. So they sent us a six pack. They said, Sean Corey, tell us what you think. I'm telling you what I think. That's, I just love that idea. I think yeah. that's so cool. I'm just a big, like, Homer type of guy. Like, I love Toledo. People probably know that. Yeah. I also love Detroit because I grew up so close to it in Michigan. Yeah. I love when people are so proud of their state or their community or whatever it is, whatever the region is, that they keep it all kind of in-house. Yeah, I think that's really cool that they did this. And for those of you who don't know, if this is your first time watching this video, Pure Michigan and Shorts, thanks you for sharing this. If you have done that, thanks you. I'm good at talking. I'm from Redford, Michigan. I went to school at Michigan State University. I've worked all around the state of Michigan. I was a journalist and I like have gone to too many city council meetings in too many different cities. I found a sandwich in one of your parks and I want to know why it didn't have mayonnaise? It means so much to me. Every time I go back home, we live in Chicago now. Every time I go back home, it's the best. I was in Detroit last weekend. Yeah. I went to Embrew, where this is the first time I had this. Detroit's got some slept on breweries, dude. It's, I've been to a it's, couple. Because it's like, you know the Mecca's like Shorts and Founders and sure. Bells. You know those. There are so many. Every time I go there, there's a new brewery, and it's the best time I could ever have. I went to a rehearsal dinner for a wedding at a brewery, and it was yeah. one of the most fun times I had in a while. It's so in Detroit. much fun. We both love Love, love, love Detroit, big time. So in the Huge rest of Michigan, I'm a, I'm a Petoskey guy, I'm a Traverse City guy. I lived on Mackinac Island. I worked at the town crier. Look at this horrible photo of me from back then. <laughs> it is deep in my roots, That's my friend. So awesome. Ugh. 300 breweries in Michigan. That's mm. fifth in the nation. Fifth. That's that's insane. That's beating 45 others, bro. <laughs> yeah, dude. This beer is super sick. We obviously very much enjoy it. I think it's a super, super tasty beer. Uh -huh. um, if you want to know more about this, they actually made a video of the behind the scenes. Oh, I yeah. made the beer. Uh, just go to michigan.org forward slash breweries and you can see that video. We'll Put a little clip up yeah, on there look for at that. you. You like how Chris, that's how real videographers do it. You like that? Not we can do that too. I can do it. We I can do, do it. that. Look at me. Look at this. This is my footage now. We got this our, footage. Look at this. <laughs> Dude, I gotta do a short brewery trip. I wanna see it with my own two eyeballs. I do too. I wanna get my retinas, my corneas. Mm -hmm. I wanna get on them in real life. Here's the real plan. Like this video, if you wanna see us do a Michigan brewery tour, like something with Pure Michigan, where let's say maybe in like the in the springtime, we go and Sean and Corey hit a bunch of places up the west side and then travel over to near Flint and like Barry. Like, do you wanna see that? Like this video. Please, because I, I wanna do it. We so are, just support us. We this know is you the only us. basis of, of us, us doing it. <laughs> like, like the video. You guys are weird. With beer comes pizza. That's just kind of the, the way beer I live. Pizza, yep. You know, that's the way I live. That's a Michigan State motto. <laughs> it sure is. Today, 
Mama Cozy's from Aldi. Aldi, big, uh, very popular in Michigan. Italian style classics, meatball marinara. Thin crust pizza with Italian style meatballs, mozzarella, asiago, parmesan, and romano cheeses over a marinara sauce. Oh, this is meatballs? This isn't even sausage? Italian style oh, meatballs. Oh, heck yeah, Remember dude. Remember we had meatball pizza from uh, Pizza yeah. Hut? Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. Dude, meatballs are good on a pizza. We loved it. Love that. All right, so this is uh, some Mama Cozy's from Aldi. We're really hungry. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, boy. Oh, man. Flavor. Dude, these herbs. I love when pizzas take the extra step to put the herbs on there. Yep. But that adds so much flavor. Yep. Keep talking about it. I'll say yep again. <laughs> are you liking this as much as me? Yeah. I was, I was hoping for a yep. Of course I <laughs> I screwed up my own bit. <laughs> You're a moron! Dude, I'm surprised at how good this is. Oh my gosh. I love the meatballs, man. That's tasty. It is really good. Do you guys ever hit Aldi? Not like hit it. You go there. Really good. I think Mama Cozy's is a new fave. Yeah, we got a video coming out soon where we had something else from them. Guys, it's really good. Cheers. It's kind of like Detroit style because like the thickness of the bread. Yeah. Like just the French bread by nature is kind of the thickness of right. the crust of Detroit style. I've been so critical of frozen pizzas lately because I'm yeah. telling you, I just don't like trashy crust. I know. That's why I kind of like the thin crust for this stuff. Yeah. It's almost harder to screw it up when it goes like super thin like this. And I agree. this is really good. Yep. And Sean was a little worried that he overcooked this. This, for me, this is a sweet spot. Yeah, I knew how much you were going to like this. And also, I read comments all the time of people think that I don't cook it enough. Well, I should have left that in. Which is minutes. crazy. We're I'm even at 10 minutes longer than what it says to. This is a brand new oven, and I always put it in longer. So, yep. like, it's not my fault. <laughs> my oven's plugged into the holes in the wall. We've done our job. We plugged it in. We got the gas line going. Wow, dude. I'm right. telling you, bro, I think it's these herbs. I mean, people are going to be like, dude, Mama Cozy's been good for years. You guys got to get woke. I know, man. Like, stop making fun of me. Shut up, I'm talking! Mama Cozy, bro. <laughs> Shout out to Bel Air, Michigan. Shout out to where uh, Will, sure. Smith, Will Smith lives. Oh, that's what they were talking about in that. Is this what this was about? I'll tell you how I became the prince of a town called Bel Air. Oh, which, which makes... A, he took a cab all the way to Bel Air, Michigan. Which makes sense because I always saw a cab to California from Philly? Forget it, yo, home to Bel Air! Yeah, that makes way more sense to go to Bel Air, yeah, Michigan. Yeah, a way shorter trip. Well, that all makes sense now. <laughs> Glad we debunked that no, myth. No. Hey, Uncle Phil! Oh. <laughs> I was super like, okay, so like, whatever, Pure Michigan, Autumn IPA. I'm like, what's an Autumn IPA? Right. I swear to God, I can't explain it. I can't put it in words. But this is an IPA that does have like a fall flavor to it. It, it sounds stupid to no, say. No, it doesn't. The hops and the malts were made When that you way. taste it, yeah. I swear to God, it has, I don't know, man. This is really good, though. I really, really, really dig this. I also like like IPAs that are way more like easy drinking, where it's like, some of them are like, you know, you can be up to like 8 9%, and you're like, oh, I'm hammered. Looking for a little slab and pickle. You're smooth sailing. Yep, yep. All right, before we rate this pizza, because you know the beer's good, I'm going to rate that as a thumbs up. Before we rate this pizza, how about a little Vlog shout out, vlog shout out, vlog shout out. Yeah, we got another channel. We sure do. We started it not too long ago, and yep. we just want to keep making sure and reminding people that we've got this other channel and hoping that you guys go over and check it out. We currently have three videos up there. All of them, I think, are freaking awesome. They're really good. It's really telling the story about Chicago and just kind of us experiencing the different events that are going out through Chicago. Our lives outside of eating frozen pizza. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's super fun. We, Of course, it, like we get to play around with the editing a lot more and have a lot of fun with that. Yeah. If you like the B-roll of the city, you'll love these. And go subscribe now because uh, very soon we're going to be having my wedding vlog come out. Oh, is that going to be a which banger? It's, it's a beast to edit. We're going to put a story together and it's going to be a lot of a lot of drinking, a lot of fun. For my wedding present to Corey, I just let him edit that video. <laughs> <laughs> Please stay on the bus. If you wouldn't mind taking the seat, it'll be just a moment. Again, wedding party, stay on the bus. The channel's linked below and also all the information about where this beer is located also is below. So there's a lot of stuff below today to click. Click that show more, go see all that stuff. Oh, this is so tasty. Dude, you dude. want to crack this other one? All right, vlog channel. Beer's great. Let's go ahead and rate this pizza. You know, is it good? Should you get it? I'm excited for you. <laughs> How far up your thumb's going to be. <laughs> right. All right, Eric, our drummer, please go up. Yeah, boy, I like it. All right, thumbs up on whether or not you liked it. Get again. You overall enjoyed the Mama Cozy's Pizza Kitchen Meatball Marinara. Oh!
heck yeah. Dude, this is for real, might be my favorite frozen pizza I've had to date. Dude. The, the crust did well for me. A Tell lot me. of times, I know, especially this combo. Tell dude, me a better combo. This is a one two punch that's never been seen before, dude. Yeah. Oh, yeah. This is excellent. Yeah. Um, the pizza, the crust was what did well. It did very it, well. It didn't, it didn't blow my mind, but like it's frozen pizza has been a big failure on the crust game yeah. for a long time. And this one, it, it, it held true. And then I'm telling you, bro, those herbs on it, the sausage, the flavoring. I loved every bite of this. Yeah. I want to keep eating more, I'm only not because we have a food review channel that we eat too much on, so. Yeah. We've had a lot of really average frozen pizzas. It's really nice to go to a new store. Like, we haven't done much Aldi shopping, if mm -hmm. at all, ever. And so for us to walk in, see this, this is the first thing we grabbed when we walked in. So the, the box did what it needed to do, and then the flavor did exactly what it needed to do. Needed to do. Needed to do. Dude, well, that's hard to say. What it needed to do. What it needed to do. Needed to do. Am I having a seizure? Needed to do. Needed to do. Needed to do. No, no, no. We'll see you guys Monday for a brand new episode of the show. Don't forget to check out Shorts. If you're in Michigan, I mean, you already know you're in the best state in the union. If you're around those states, go there and then find this beer. Shorts, yeah. mwah, I love Except it, Except for college football, right? <laughs> uh, <laughs> boom, sure, I'll boom. get depressed and have a drink. <laughs> we don't even need Urban Meyer, okay?